What is going on y'all and welcome back to American Plains Mudding. Now in this video we're going to be diving into some of the new things in the holiday update and we're going to be checking out some trucks that we haven't driven before. Now if you go on the main page or I should say the front page for this game they do have a little bit of a list of what has been updated. Some new uh, holiday vehicles have been added as well as several bug fixes and a couple of other things. But what we're going to do is we're going to enjoy this holiday update and see what it has to offer in a gameplay sense. So without any further ado let's go ahead and jump right into it and also make sure y'all let me know in the comment section down below if there's anything specific that you guys would like to see but without any further ado let's go ahead and head on out of the building and grab a vehicle now uh this person has been idling very loudly out here for a moment or two so let's see i wonder what this person is going to end up spawning in now oh dude they're putting together like a whole tanker setup all right let me just head on over here and grab a truck because I don't want to, like, crowd the parking lot over there. All right, so let me go ahead and head over here. We should be pretty clear. Yo, that cab over is sick, though. Uh, well, I was gonna... Okay, never mind. We're good. I was like, I was gonna bring in a vehicle over here. So we could run this uh, newer generation Duramax single wheel or the dually version down here. This one's a little bit more of a GMC front end. We could do a newer Dodge. We could do uh, like a 6.4 generation uh, Power Stroke Ford. But what I'm actually going to check out is these limited vehicles down here. This one is a Christmas present. And I... Yep, that is exactly what it looks like. That is a drivable Christmas present. Oh, 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 oh God. And it... Christmas. And it, it, apparently it says, it apparently it tells you Merry Christmas. All right. So let's go ahead and actually delete that real quick because those bells are going to probably go on and on and on and on. But let's actually grab, I tell you what, we're going to grab something we haven't really driven before. Let's grab this, a newer generation Duramax. So let's see, where are you going to be? Right there. All right, let's go ahead and hop on in and see what this thing is like to drive. And I'm also really curious to see if they've changed any different aspects of the map because obviously, as you can see, there's Christmas trees, there's lights. So we're going to explore the map and see what's going on out here. I wonder if I can go over there and grab that gooseneck. Part of me is like, I kind of want to do it. I'm not going to lie. I kind of want to do it. But at the same time, I feel like someone spawned that in specifically for themselves, and I'm not going to take it from them. So, I will say, though, I do kind of want to see if I can spawn in my own trailer. Because I've never tried to do that in this game before. So, let's see. Do we have... Uh, it doesn't seem like they're in the main spawn list. I wonder if they're, like, somewhere else that you have to go. So, what I might do... Here, let's see. What I might do is jump back into this thing and see... Oh, not in the back seat. Let's see. Are they going for that trailer, or am I going to go for it? Let's see. Well, they don't seem like they're going for it. Okay, I'm sure... Oh, I bet you have to go to that circle over there. Let's see. Nobody seems to be going for this, but I'm not going to steal it. I, I, I would feel really, really, really bad about stealing it. So I'll tell you what. Let me head on out of the vehicle, and let me run over here and see. I said, I said, run. I said, run. Can we not... Oh, wow. You know, it's been a minute since I've... Aha! There we go. Gooseneck trailer. Boom. All right. Now, now there should be another gooseneck that should be ready for us. All right. There it is. Yes, that's exactly what I wanted. Okay, cool. Now, as far as spawning in yet another vehicle, I'm not sure if or how we could do that. Excuse me. Right, let me back this thing up. Okay, there we go fully coupled. Now, here's my question. Those trailer legs, do they raise on their own? Or do they... Let's see. There's nothing in here for... Ow. There's nothing in here for the actual like trailer controls. So, I almost wonder if it's something we have to do like on our own. Like, if we have to manually interact with the crank handle or something. Oh! You do! Oh, that's actually really cool. That's so freaking cool. And if you click on the ramps, do they just come down? Let's see. Yes, they do! Oh, that's amazing. That's so freaking cool. Oh, that's so freaking cool. Okay, now if I spawn another vehicle, please tell me it's not gonna, like, get rid of my main truck. Oh, no! It got rid of my truck! Oh, crap. I really wanted to put this on the trailer and then drive off. God dang it. That, I really, really, really wanted to do that. That's sad. 
That's so sad. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. I still want to pull the trailer. So we'll go ahead and spawn this truck back in. And then, oh, it is now orange. Okay, all right. Well, don't worry about it. Uh, it's It spends a little bit of time in the paint shop. It's fine. All right, let's go and back you on up. And, oh, I guess we weren't lined up well enough. Come on. Oh, my God. This is so, like, this is so, like, back and forth. Oh, my God. Now it's mad. Now it's mad at me and it won't hook up. Okay. All right. Well, we're just going to take this thing out and see what it's actually like to drive in some of the muddy areas because that trailer now is just mad at me and doesn't want to hook up to my truck. So I'm going to let it be and let it chill for now. Now, let's see. We've got a beach area out here, which I haven't really spent all that much time in. But that road is actually... It almost looks like they've improved the textures of that road. Maybe I'm wrong, but... Oh, they are absolutely hauling. Or at least they were headed in like they were absolutely hauling. Come on. Ease it along. This thing is actually... I think it's actually not bad at all. There's a little bit of mud out here. Oh, there's some mud. Oh, yeah. We found some proper mud. All right. Let's go. I want to start the trail in, like, the proper place where they actually want you to start it, though. Because I don't want to be like I just, you know, randomly drove up and was like, yeah, I'm just going to, like, randomly start going into the mud here. All right, let's ease this thing in. Oh, God. Come on. Yeah, I'm going to just put you in first. Oh, okay. All right, that's properly deep. Come on. I genuinely don't know if I've been to this trail before or not, because this trail seems like a trail I've been to before, but at the same time, it doesn't. And the reason I say it doesn't is because I don't know if I went to any of the trails that were by the water or not. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I want to bring the four-wheeler out here. This looks perfect for that four-wheeler. Here, let me see if we can give it some beans headed down this trail. Full beans? Oh, yeah. Not even a single issue with it at all. Now, let's go ahead and hop on out. And we're going to go ahead and delete that rig. And we're going to spawn in a, yes, a lifted mud tire ready freaking four-wheeler. This is exactly what we're going to want for that area. At least, I feel like it is. Now, I could be making a very bad call on this. We might sink. We absolutely might sink, but let's see. Here we go. I mean, it sinks a little bit, but it's not like it cares, dude. Like, it literally just rips right around wherever you end up going. You can leave it in second and it'll still work. Look at this. Okay, it gets properly deep out there, but it still made it through no problem. And it made it through in third at that. Will it climb this wall? Uh, not in second. Oh, no! Oh, we almost did it. All right. I'm gonna try again in first. It's too steep. It's just way too steep. There's no way. All right, hold on. Let me make my way around this tree and hit it with some beans back the other way. It's still not gonna do it. Yeah, it's still not gonna do it. It's just way too steep. I figured we would give it our best effort, but, I mean, sometimes it's like, oh, where are they going? Yo! Look at these setups! These setups are sick! I wonder if they'll... I wonder if they'll get mad if I jump onto their trailer. Come back! Hold on, where are you going? Oh my god, thank you for finally getting up onto the roadway. Jeez! I know I'm technically not supposed to be up here on a four-wheeler, but don't worry about that. Are those hay bales out there? I feel like it's an odd time to have a bunch of hay bales lined up when it's completely, like, snowed in. But then again, I mean, that depends on where you live and what time of year it is. Come back! I just want to put my four-wheeler on your trailer. God, this thing goes 73 miles an hour. That's pretty impressive for a little four-wheeler. Here, let me pull up behind them and see. Oh! Oh, they might do it. They might do it. Dude, they did it! Yes! That's so sick! Oh my god, they did it! Alright, now, let me- Oh god! Oh no! 
Uh, well, uh, apparently glitches happened. Um, well, apparently they wanted me on the trailer, but the, uh, the trailer itself did not want me on the trailer. But that happens. I mean, bugs and glitches are gonna happen. It really in any game. I'm gonna, you know what, since that trailer did not want me on it, I'm gonna go ahead and go into this bug game. That's the beauty of this game, is that they give you options to do kind of whatever you want, whenever you want. I've never driven this thing before, but I will definitely drive it again. This thing rips! I wonder how far across the map I can make it without slowing down. Ooh, let's see if we can make it up to the top of that mountain over there. Easy. Whoa, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I gotta get it out of fourth. Third, it's pretty happy in. Oh my god. That took away basically all of my speed. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Alright, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, maybe, maybe not. I am not gonna lift. Oh, there we go. You have to kind of go diagonally to get it to climb these hills, but it will do it. Use some momentum. Yo, we... Wow, we legit have almost made it to the top already. Holy crap. Now, does this kind of sp spiral climb? In a way, it does, but there's a massive, like, gatekeeper obstacle right there. Oh, 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 no, 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 no! Well, that went well. Uh, it's not slowing down anytime soon. God dang it. Well, um... Our attempt to climb the mountain was absolutely thwarted by the mountain itself. But if y'all enjoyed this look at the holiday edition of American Plains Mudding, let me know anything else that you would like to see in the comment section down below. And once again, that's going to do it for this video. But if you did enjoy and you would like to see more, hit that subscribe button and turn those notifications on. And I will see y'all next time.